Blessings, Lafayette family and Facebook friends. My daily message for Saturday, April 23rd. And I remind you that daily messages, Sunday worship, lots of great stuff are at fountainchurchtallahassee.org. And join us every Sunday at 1030 a.m. for worship. My scripture today is John 11, verse 10. But if anyone walks in the night, he stumbles because the light is not in him. This is the word of the Lord. You've heard, I know, about the Middle Ages, the Dark Ages, where everything was depressing and there were diseases and learning wasn't encouraged and the church crushed any scientific discovery. These are some of the myths and near myths of the Middle Ages. The truth is medieval times weren't as dark as we thought. Universities taught that the world was around long before Columbus. The church encouraged science because it was the study of God's creation. Now, sometimes the church did superimpose theology upon science. But you know what's interesting? In most cases, it wasn't led by church leaders. It was everyday folk who were trying to make a name for themselves. And very often there were people who had their own agendas and so they would press against science. And, of course, the church was complicit often. But the important thing for us to remember is that like today, human beings are curious. We all want to know. We all want to learn. And science is merely an instrument to learn more, and it is self-correcting, even if science is wrong for a long time. Now, that doesn't mean we should swallow everything hook, line, and sinker, but we should invest in our own minds, learning, seeking knowledge, finding ways to improve our lives. On the other hand, as a church, as Christians... As a faith, we should always remind the world that it is the God of creation behind all that we inspect, all that we research, all that we observe. All our experiments are based on the creation that God has given us. And we pray that we too will be enlightened to be able to discern and to learn and grow. And I pray that we will not allow this age to become a dark age of conflict and where opinion sometimes trumps fact. We pray that we would be blessed as we seek to learn and grow. Let us pray. Lord, we thank you for the opportunity to learn and grow. We thank you that you've given us good minds but we pray that we would always lead with faith. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Grace to you and peace from God our Father and the Lord Jesus Christ.